Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, just to talk about uh, the uh, private versus public setting in Windows, we're going to check out where that setting is in Windows 10. And if you've watched a Windows 11 uh, video, well, it has the same, um, works in the same way, but we'll still uh, repeat a little bit the information, the basic information of both. In Windows 10, the public versus uh, private setting in Windows for the Wi-Fi connectivity is a little different. So you go to your settings app by right clicking on the start button or just clicking the start button and clicking the settings gear, go into network and internet. And here the difference is that you will see your connection. So here it says where I'm connected Wi-Fi, and you need to go to properties. Properties is the place where the public or private network profile is. And once again, you can set it to public or private by default, Microsoft puts it in public mode. Why? Because it is shut down. Um, there's kind of a non logic um, explanation here. Somebody was explaining to me at once that he thought public meant that, you know, uh, your computer is open. Well, no, it's, it means it's shut. It's really closed down on the network. So by default, public, once again, if you have only one PC and uh, you connect to public Wi-Fi regularly, this should be set to public so that the network settings and windows are shut down so that your PC cannot be seen on the networks. Um, when you scan a network, and I've done that a few times with devices just to see if I could uh, identify other PCs, I've noticed that it happens quite often that uh, PCs are discoverable and you can even sometimes even snoop on some of the stuff people have on their computers. So public is where you need to be for the most part. But of course, if you have more than one computer and you have a home network with multiple devices, then you might want to set it to private so that your computers can see each other. And so you can, of course, activate all sorts of features, including sharing files folders and uh, sometimes private is needed also for some devices that might be on your network uh, like smart TVs, smart devices of all kinds that you might purchase. Sometimes it will need to have that setting set to private in order for these devices to actually be used with your computer. Private is only used in your home, in your home network with your known computers and devices nowhere else never use private when you are on a public wi-fi because that's a danger dangerous way to actually connect to public um, wi-fi is that once again i have a lot of people that are trying to do bad stuff there they try to uh, see if they can actually access your computers and steal information and so on so public for most people is fine you just leave it alone and if you have a lot of stuff, a lot of PCs and a lot of things on your home network at home, then private is where you want to be so that you can actually connect each device with each other. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.